Okay, so uh, now we're going to run through uh, the first uh, part of the tendon stretching and joint opening exercises. Um, like I said, we'll do the upper body first, but before we begin that, I'd like to show you the foot movement and foot posture, uh, because uh, this will remain basically the same throughout the upper body set. So let's just look at the legs and the feet first. So if we kind of look at the legs, so basically what we're going to do to begin the, the posture, uh, we are going to slowly um, open the feet into a wide posture, so heel, toe, heel, toe. And we want to splay the feet outwards uh, at an angle. We don't want what we would normally see in a sort of a horse stance with the feet um, sort of parallel and the toes slightly curling inwards. So we don't want this horse stance in this fashion for the tendon stretching exercise. We want this splayed open uh, leg posture. This allows the energy to freely flow down through the leg, so you're not actually causing any stress on the knees or any other parts uh, of the joints. Okay, so then we also want to sit into the hips a little bit, like we're sitting on the edge of a bar stool. Okay, uh, knees slightly bent and just relax. Also, just to check from the side, uh, the bottom, we're not tucking the tailbone underneath like we perhaps would in a horse stance. We also have a slight um, arch in the lower back, so you just really naturally sit into the hips like that. Okay, so that's how we would be standing for most of the upper body set, but when we bring the feet together towards the end of the upper body set, we also peel the feet back in, in the same way, so toe, heel, toe, heel, and you'll end up with your feet uh, also in the splayed open set. This time though, we will be standing tall again, we won't have our knees bent. So when we bring the feet back in, you'll be standing tall, but of course not a straight, uh, rigid leg, just slight, very slight bend in the knees. Okay, so that's going to be the postures for the feet. And in a moment, I'm going to show you how we'll hold the hand postures.